Hey everyone, thank you for tuning in to CryptoZX. If this is your first time coming onto the channel, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But now, let's get right in today's content. Before I begin, just wanted to give you guys a quick disclaimer as always that anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrencies. Today, you guys might have already guessed which project I'm covering, a project that I absolutely love, and that project is none other than Polygon Matic. Looking at the price of Matic right now, it is currently trading at 86.4 cents, up 2.6% in the last 24 hours in USD comparative, also up 1.6% in Bitcoin and 1.3% in Ethereum comparative over the last 24 hours. Our current rank is still holding very, very strong at that top 10 spot, so that's definitely something nice to note. Market cap sitting at $7.6 billion and the 24-hour trading volume currently sitting at $200 million. So what are some price targets that we should be looking at for Polygon Matic? Are we finally about to break and see new yearly highs for the year of 2022? Or are we going to see a little bit of more downwards trend? So we're going to go through all these options for you guys. But before we get into the price, I just wanted to share a very interesting article with you guys. This tweet is posted by If the Car Post. He mentions breaking news: Matic Polygon NFT OpenSea total sales surpasses 2021 volume and crosses over 300 million in 2022. Now, and now you may be coming and saying, NFTs are dead. NFTs are dead, and we have yet here Polygon Op you know OpenSea total volume look at it it's two times i'm sorry three times more than it was last year what does that show you not just that doesn't show us that shows us two things one it doesn't show it shows us that there's a lot of interest still in nfts nfts are here to stay and the polygon overall ecosystem is growing at a tremendous rate and a lot of people are interested in this and the future for polygon matic it just gets me very very excited what the future holds so i just wanted to share this with you guys and really show you what's happening even though we are in a bear market but now let's get right into the price and see what's exactly happening for the price and where are we going in the immediate short term as you guys can see price is currently trading at 86.2 cents mark if I do bring up the measuring tool for you guys, since all-time high, which was on December of last year, honestly, uh, since then, you guys can see the price has retraced about 70%, and that's extremely bullish. Now, you may be saying, Crypto ZX, have you lost your mind? Why are you saying, you know, that Polygon retracing about 70% is bullish? The reason as to why I believe that is because... I've always mentioned this on my channel. Um, if this is your first time stopping onto the channel, I will mention it again. You guys can go look around across the board, major top you know, 20 or 30 currencies, you can take them. And a majority of them from all time highs from last year are down 85 to 95% around that range. And we have Polygon Matic down 70%. It's outperforming BTC right now. It's outperforming Bitcoin. And what does that show us? That shows us the interest that is coming in a Polygon. Not only from retail side, this interest is coming from the institutional side. I've mentioned with you guys some of the big names around the world that are working and using the Polygon Matic, you know, overall ecosystem. And what does that show us? That shows us where Polygon really is headed. And as Sandeep says, Polygon is going to be top three project and I definitely see that happening considering what they're doing the amount of development that they're making in a bear market partnerships they're making it gets me more and more bullish as time goes by now if I do bring out the closer picture you guys can see price has been hovering in the 78.6 around these ranges for quite some time now, the next target that we're looking at in order for us to really see an upwards trend and get back into the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement level, we do need to see the price of Polygon go above this dollar mark. And if I do bring out the measuring tool for you guys, we're currently away about 16% for us to get back above there. Now, one thing I do want you guys to keep in mind is 
last time the price of Polygon Matic was above there was back on November 12th because you guys can see this FTX collapse that really impacted the entire market because of the price of Bitcoin to collapse as well. We saw Polygon retrace quite a bit. And if I do bring out the measuring tool for you guys, we saw Polygon drop about 40%. And if you picked up some Polygon around the 76 cents mark, that might have been a good time to be picking up some Matic. And look at this bounce. This bounce makes me extremely bullish. Look at this bounce towards the upside. We retested the 61.8 Fib level and then we retraced a little bit. But despite that fact, Polygon has been holding above this level of support at that 73 cents and that is very, very nice to see. And if I do bring out something for you guys, if you were picking up the yearly lows, we're still up about 171% from the yearly lows. And I personally don't see the price of Polygon Matic going back down to those levels, even if the price of Bitcoin goes to 11K, which I've been saying that can happen. Unless Elon Musk starts pumping the cryptocurrency markets, that will be a total different scenario. A lot of people are saying that he is going to start um, you know, talking about Dogecoin, and hence Dogecoin is pumping. And I believe that could start a bull run sooner than a lot of people expected. But let's not forget, the entire year of 2021 was a bear market. And uh, I still think that Q1 of 2023 is going to be a little bearish. We are going to test lower uh, price ranges for the price of BTC. But you never know what can happen. In order for me to turn bullish, now you may be saying, Crypto CX, when will you ever turn bullish? In order for me to officially come and say, you know what, I'm bullish again, it's going to be above $22,000. This $22,000 level of resistance is very, very important for the price of Bitcoin. And if we go above this, that's where I will turn bullish. And that's when I will get excited. But until then, that's definitely not the case. And I'm not bullish at all right now <coughs> excuse me i'm kind of still under the weather you know a lot of uh you know weather changing and you guys already know the drill uh so do not mind me if i do cough here and there uh but yeah like i said the price of btc needs to be above 22k mark for me to really get excited and if the price of btc were to be at 22k mark i do think matic will be back into the 0.50 fibonacci retracement level and you guys already know how i treat the 38.2 zone when the price gets back into these levels right here, around here, that's where I start talking about all-time highs. And that's where a lot of excitement happens. And if you were, you know, thinking, well, let's say you have done your due diligence, you really do believe Matic is the project, and you've done your due diligence, if you've done that, and you were wishing to be picking up some Matic around these all-time highs, pick them up now. Dollar cost average it now, rather than picking it up when the market has inflated quite a bit. And that is something I strongly encourage uh, to dollar cost average in when the prices are extremely low rather than when it's extremely high. But at the end of the day, you guys do what works for you. Always do your own due diligence and research when you're investing in crypto. But that is it for today's update. Let me know what you guys think where you could see the price of Matic go in the year of 2023. I see Matic trading above uh, $4 in 2023. And that is even before the major bull cycle. But let me know. I would love to know your thoughts down below. Come join the Crypto ZX Army. I will see you guys tomorrow. It's been Crypto ZX and peace out.